Hey, hey, you guys, this is Marche Hanner from Online DBA Academy. And I decided to make a quick video. This is going to be very quick and to the point. Um, I wanted to discuss Oracle has a new certification program uh, relating to Oracle 19C. And they have a few things that have changed. So I wanted to go over those things with you guys to let you know just the new way that they're doing testing. In a way, I don't like it. I think it's them trying to make more money. Um, it, it It's also, in a way, I see that they're trying to make it a bit more difficult. But then again, it's Oracle doing what they do. Nonetheless, it won't be a thing for Online DBA Academy to help anybody out with the new structure. So without further ado, we are going to go ahead and just pull up the new testing structure that they have. I'm going to go here to show anybody how to get to the new um, testing schedule. Um, well, I'm sorry, the new testing curriculum. Um, and this is how I found out about it. I am a part of um, the RSS feed for certification. So uh, this certification block, I went here and right here it says Oracle certification highlights August 2019, right? And in this blog, um, as you can tell, this was written August 16, 2019. I believe today is the 27th or the 28th of August. So as you can see, it's talking about upgrade, but if you scroll on down, it says pass these exams. So there's two exams in administration one and administration two. So that caught my eye immediately. I didn't see anything related to OCA. So I'll start there and say OCA is no longer available. Oracle certified associate, that's no longer available. If you see here, it says earn I didn't mean to highlight everything. Not sure what's going on with my computer. But it says earn this certification via one of these paths. I have no clue what's going on here. But this is new certification path, Oracle Database 2019, certified professional. So they go right into you being a professional. You have to take these two tests in order to become a professional. In the past, you would take SQL and like database administration one, and that would make you an OCA certified DBA. But now they've done away with OCA and you have to take database, Oracle database administration one and Oracle database administration two in order to receive your OCP. And the database administration two used to be a test by itself, but now they have made these two tests they placed them together, so now you have to do that in order to become certified. So what I want to do in this video is go over both of the uh, tests with you guys so you would know um, what's going on. You can click on these links, but for anybody who don't know how to get here or need assistance, you can just go to Google. Okay, I just figured out why my screen did not highlight, I mean, it was highlighted. So, okay, here, what we're going to do is we will type in Oracle OCP 19C certification path. Oracle OCP 19C certification path. And they have the certification path here. So as you all can see, if you scroll down, they have all the certification paths here for database administration. So we are, this is 18C. All right. Okay. I don't see 19C here. Uh, okay, here it is, scrolling down. So if you scroll down, here it is. So again, you don't see OCA. OCA is no longer here. So we're going to click on this one. And as you can see, it says step one, pass this exam, which is 
1Z0082. And then step two, you have to pass the 1Z0083 exam. So if we click on the 82 exam, all right, so if you can see, this exam is $245, multiple choice, number of questions is 90, you only need a 60% to get a passing score. So you want to scroll down. Now we're going to look at review exam topics. So let's just look at some of these topics and then I'll explain what um, Oracle has done. So this is understanding Oracle database architecture. That's database administration 101. Um, managing users role and privileges. Managing data. Configuring Oracle net services. Managing undo. Okay. So here, this says using conversion functions and conditional expression. This is SQL. So they've combined it SQL and uh, the, the database administration test one together. So that's SQL. I see SQL here. This is SQL. Uh, that's database. Here's SQL. Here's SQL. This is SQL, this is SQL, SQL. So that's what they've done. They've combined Oracle SQL fundamentals and the Oracle database portion for OCA. They've combined that into one test. So this is going to be considered Oracle Database Administration 1. So if we go back... We have Oracle Database Administration 2. So we look at this. This is 245. Uh, multiple choice, 85 questions. You need a 57% to pass. So if we go to exam topics and we look at these, Okay, creating CDBs and regular PDBs, backup and duplicate, managing applications, PDBs, recovery and flashback, backup strategies. Okay, so basically what the second test is, it's going to be further knowledge on backup and recovery and new features. See, new features for administrator, new features for administrators. So it's going to mainly be new features plus some of the normal things. Uh, see, this is upgrading the Oracle database, creating an Oracle database using the DBCA. Some of this was on, it used to be on the first test, but they have placed it in a second test. So um, what they did was they got rid of Oracle SQL and they placed some of Oracle SQL in the first test and back up in recovery They've mainly made that for the second test along with new features. So, okay. Um, but, yes, I wanted to show you guys this so that you would have the information. Also, another thing I noticed with Oracle certification is you can now take any test online. It will be proctored, meaning it's not like the old test. The old test, they let you take Oracle SQL at home. And, you know, people, yes, they used books. They did whatever they could to pass, and they did pass. But now, with this new certification, there will be someone watching you. They will be able to see using your webcam. And they're basically just looking at everything you do. So if you open up another browser... They're going to close the test. If it looks like you're looking at a book, they're going to close the test. Um, they are stepping up their game as far as having people who are cheating. So um, I wanted to bring that to your path, to your uh, attention. Also, I found this document. Let's see. Can I find it? Where is it? Did I have it open? Yes, this document here, and I'll put, I'll put, I'll paste this in the description. This is 
um, Oracle database certification questions answered. So if you look at this first one, why is there only one Oracle database administration administrative certification now rather than associates and OCP levels? So they sort of answer these questions here. As you can see, this is a lot to read, so I won't be reading it, but I will post this link because it definitely helped me understand what was going on. I mean, I don't really know how I feel about them taking away OCA. I think it was a great um, introductory certification, but now they want to make people go right to professional. I, be I believe you guys remember me saying you know, in the past, you should not get your OCP unless you have experience. Now it seems with Oracle doing all the upgrades and updates, it seems like you don't have a choice. You have to get your OCP. This will make studying even longer um, and a bit more difficult and challenging. But, hey, that's where Online DBA Academy comes in. Our success rate of getting people who are not only passing um, – not only passing certifications, but also getting jobs. We have a very successful rate at doing that. So we we are going to be more than happy to assist. I can tell you we don't have a course now for this, but I saw this information this morning. So please know I've already started mapping out my curriculum based off of the exam topics that I just showed you all. So you guys can expect for me to have a certification course for this very soon. And I will also make sure you guys know, and I'll also link my new certification to this video just in case somebody is looking. But other than that, this is all I have for you guys. This was a very quick video, nothing special. I wanted you guys to go ahead and get this. So with that said, this is... Marche Hanna, Oracle DBA girl from Online DBA Academy, signing off. God bless. Happy studies. If y'all need me for anything, reach out, 678-506-1235. I'm not putting a share video. I'm not putting a share graphic or any other graphics on this video. So you guys know what to do. Please like, please comment, please subscribe, and please hit the share video for this. I meant the share button for this. Marche Hanner signing off. God bless.